Okay, we are recording. Back in Elm Wake. Time has struck. I lost my gun in the crash. Barry was nowhere to be seen. It's more importantly the uh, flashlight being lost. That's the problem. Barry! Barry! Oh, man, you're okay! Jeez, it's good to hear your voice! I was trying to get out of the car, but the ground gave way! Man, what a drop! And don't worry, your cutout is fine. Forget that! Are you okay? I hit some bushes, didn't get a scratch! There's no way you can climb down, though! It's like a sheer wall! Ah! Ow! There's something moving down here! Barry, it's a taken! Use a flare, Barry! Oh! Yeah! Barry, are you alright? <laughs> I'm good, Al! I'm great! Guess he never messed with anyone from New York City before, huh? Yeah, somehow I don't think that New Yorkers are necessarily going to be better at surviving than others. You find your way around to the farm, Al! I'll be waiting! Barry, just wait for me, okay? Al, I'm not staying here! It's suicide! I'm going to the farm! I'm going to go ahead and secure the area! You can catch up! Don't worry about it! I'm on the case! Now he's Rambo. This would turn into a disaster if I didn't catch up with Barry. You think it's not already a disaster? Oh, that's not good. Oh, don't, don't do that. Ow. I'm gonna go with that's the only thing. If there is anything else, I'm just gonna hope, like, get, get a flashlight or something up here. It's a manuscript page. When he stopped the car at the Anderson farm, Walter felt relieved. Oblivion was close at hand. The brothers wouldn't miss a jar of moonshine or two in the booby hatch. But then he saw the man on the porch, and he knew who it was. Driving for his life and knowing it was useless, he didn't realize he was crying until he couldn't see the road for the tears. Hmm. I'm trying to remember which one Walter is. Really need to not run. <laughs> See, so can build up some stamina. Shadows crawled over the gate. I needed a light to destroy them to get through. Another page. Agent Nightingale stared at the passed out rider. The man was sleeping off one hell of a night. Nightingale felt a stab of envy at Wake's oblivion, but he had a job to do. 
He put the gun to Wake's head and almost became a murderer. His hands shook and his throat felt tight and dry. Biting his teeth, he tried again to pull the trigger. He lost the nerve. Wake stirred. Nightingale would have to settle for an arrest. There's anything over here? Ah, I see. I see. What is over here, if any? Nothing. Okay. I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. No batteries with it this time. Only a freaking funny asset to get the heart. The dodge does kinda suck. I could sense the movement in the woods ahead. Facing the enemy without a weapon was dangerous, but I had no choice. Yeah. <laughs> Say, I want to pick up the batteries, and then it's like, nope, no, you, you're trying to start this. It's like, no, I don't want to start that. I want to try to pick up the batteries. Now I need to dodge. Oh, I can't dodge there, so I died. No choice. What I really need is a freaking flare. Hmm. Will these guys just show up different? Oh, that's actually worse for me. Then. Oh, I thought I thought I only had one hit left on. I guess you do regenerate health, and I just I could didn't know that, so I just stood there, thought I was dead, because it's like. Well, I, but I had no choice. Yeah. <sighs> okay, what I have is not necessarily a good idea, but it, it's something. Because I, there's no way, especially since they're throwing. There's, there's nothing I can do. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna say screw them for now. And do that. 
because that seems to every time you get to a new light like that it seems like it wipes the enemies Now where there? So that way I can come back, do whatever this will do. Okay. So. I thought I saw something up path. Guess not. Okay. I was just seeing back to where I was. So then that would have been a way to get rid of the ones that had been... The, the three that had followed me. Nope, that was just the uh, flashlight catching. Nothing up here. A car was driving away from the farm, headed in the same general direction as I was. For all I knew, it was Barry, caught in the consequences of leaping before looking. Well, in theory, Nightingale needs to arrive. Oh, yeah. There we do. Thermos, battery. And I'm not sure if the, there's any advantage to the heavy duty aside from just it has a longer charge to it. The car was heading for the cabin up ahead. It wasn't far. If it was Barry. I would see the damage soon. It's not going to be Barry. Walter, maybe? Thank you, Zane. I had seen glimpses of the light before. I had seen it in my dream. It was a strange spaceman or a diver in a bulky suit. He was the one who'd been placing the pages on my path. The dark presence followed the choreography laid out to it in the manuscript, growing stronger and stronger, moving like a storm from one scene of destruction to the next. But it was still bound to follow the story and chained to the dark place it came from. When the story reached the end it longed for, it would finally be free. I just want to look around. Oh, hey. Yeah, so I did miss a page. But it can't have been that far! So it makes me very curious. And you're long for the ride now. Maybe. I honestly don't even remember the way I came. This is the way. Okay. See, it would make sense if it were around here. But I really do have the feeling that it is Zane personified as, well, it being the personality to the light. I'm just so curious about the page that I missed. And now I do have a flashlight, so I can go back and investigate some things that I could not before.
Oh, I can't go up there. Is anything... Nope. So if it's back further, I am unable to get it. And it probably is. Drat. Yeah, because this is more like where they share the uh, perspective of somebody else. Because that does seem to be how it is set up. That the pages that you get starting at the top are his perspective. The other pages are more likely somebody else's. Like the one that was a Nightingale's perspective that I got recently. <clears throat> Alright. Now the question also becomes, not only do I replay the game to try to get the, uh, the pages I didn't get, but do I replay it well, on Nightmare, and do I choose to record it? <clears throat> kind of feeling like, you know, I could, but I, I don't know. More the traps. I'm left a little curious. They head off here. Does that... Is that meant as kind of a hint that, hey, I've hidden something up here? Oh, and one other thing. I did check. The PC version does indeed have the, um, the DLC. The storm raged on as the Anderson brothers walked unsteadily away from the clinic Dang with the drink. other patients in tow, knowing that this time they wouldn't return. The darkness around them seethed with horrors, but Tor and Odin were unafraid. Their eyes glinted with guile. They knew every secret path, and there was blood on their hands. They had fought these shades before. Someone had left a gun behind. Now I had a fighting chance of reaching the farm. Yeah, I'm gonna trust that that was... that was it. Just the thermos here. Although that is tempting. Just having a peek like this. Up here. I'd be tempted to put something up here if I were a developer. Don't know what, not sure if I care what. Still be tempted to do. Hmm. That's a trap. There's. A... See, it doesn't make sense that they would have been out here alone.
thought to uh, hit him with the light first. I just couldn't remember if... He... Son of a bitch. Really hope that was the last one. It was not. Ah, oh, crap. see the car, but there was no sight of the driver. Hello? Anybody here? Ah! Barry! Ah! Ah! No! Danny, you're not! Ah! Please! Ah! What are you? Please! Ah! No! Don't! I'm sorry! Ah! You were in jail the other day. I went to the farm again for the moonshine, you know? It makes you see. They're, they're not gonna miss it. They're in the loony bin. My buddy, Danny, I lost him. Something's gone wrong with him. It's not him. Like a real bad follow-up. To a real good movie? The best friends. Suddenly the bad guy. Who, who wrote this crap anyway? I've run through every possible course in my head. If I continue like the Dark Presence wants me to, the story I'm writing won't save Alice. It's a horror story, and it's going to kill her, and me, and everybody in this town. No one will survive. Darkness will consume everything. This is what it's wanted all along. It will be free, unstoppable. It used Alice to get to me, dangled her in front of me to keep me going. It was never going to release her. I'm going to change this. I'll escape. I've written myself into the story. I'm now the protagonist. This feels like a terrible risk, but it's the only way to save Alice. I'll be bound by the events of the story just as much as anyone else who's been woven into it. The story must stay true for this to work. There have to be victims along the way, near escapes, cliffhangers. In a horror story, it can't be certain that the hero will succeed or even survive. He almost has to die. I'll write my own escape into the story next. I need help. Zane's going to be the one who will help me. I'll make it happen. Okay. So I have been correct that the light has been Zane. But now we also understand his missing weak inside. So he lost the week writing it. The front door was locked. But because of writing himself in, he forgot it. The farm was still a good distance away. I'd need a car to get there fast. For a moment, Hartman considered strangling the idiot. Mott was mean-spirited, but easily manipulated. An emotional infant who lived for his approval. Wake, by contrast, was a far more difficult subject. Maude had given him too much leash. In two days, who knew what could happen? Hartman would have to find a way to rein him in, and quickly.
Yeah, there won't be anything over there. I am kind of getting a sense of how they do the, uh, how they place the collectibles. If Barry wasn't up here, he was probably in trouble down at the farm. For a moment, I felt bad for doubting him. After all, I made it this far myself. But Barry was Barry. Head up there. Yep, right here. That's what I want. I'm sure everyone's noticed that storm we all felt coming is finally here. The boys at the Weather Service reckon it'll last until morning, at the very least. Uh, pertaining to that, let me uh, read that missing persons alert again. The Sheriff's Department's still looking for a Caucasian woman, 30 years old, slim and blonde with blue eyes. She may be lost in the woods, and it's possible she's been injured in a car accident. If you see her, please make sure you get her indoors and call the sheriff. It's bad weather to be caught out. So that's uh, looking for Alice. The area who maybe looks a little confused. Give him a hand, all right? <clears throat> this is Pat Main on KBF FM. Hoping you're all safe and warm tonight. At least I'm pretty sure that fits the description of Alice. That door. I just. Yep. Look. Dude, really can't just have the radio on in the car. to walk from here.
I, I would put something in the circle of trees there. But there isn't anything there. Didn't mean to crash it. Meant to actually try to drift it in, to slide it in. But I have a feeling that thing's about to wake up. Yep. Nope, can't drive it. Accidentally actually wrecked it. No way in here, it seems. Kind of a shame. Kind of a shame. Unless you can... No. You can't just grab onto that. Oh, wait, no. Well, it's a door, but cannot be. How about this? It can be opened. Being pointed. I would definitely, if this is an outhouse, no, it might just be a shed. If it were an outhouse, I would def- oh, no, it is, it is an outhouse. Oh, man, they should have put an, a manuscript page in there. I'm just, come on, come on, that would have been funny, that would have been funny. But I also guess it's something that Zane wouldn't do, so... Hey, I'm a writer too. Not a successful or probably even all that good a one, but uh it's still, you know, you, you can you can poke fun. Can't poke fun, then why are you passionate about something? I'd known the brothers used to be some kind of rock stars, but it hadn't really sunk in until I saw the stage. Ow! Run! They're coming! There's too many of them! God 
I tried dodging, but it was like, eh, no. The dodge really does kind of show. I've said that multiple times. But at least it did do this. For me. You know, I, I got a checkpoint there. Please, please, please! please. Oh, cute. Defeat 20 taken with indirect means. Okay, I, achievement unlocked, collateral damage. Oh. Ooh. I don't get to keep it, do I? The hell did you come from? This is super annoying. Absolute bullshit, this dodging! <laughs> that, hey, hang on. I'm trying to stop and reset the timer, and it's just like, nah. No, no, no! Why do you keep doing this to me? Do it for Barry, please, please, please! What the hell? Stop it!
Well done, baby. Ooh. Okay. Maybe not what... Well... Probably end up being good in the long run. <laughs> that was awesome! Bright Falls, rock and roll capital of America. Hey, ow! This way to the farm! I want to get as stocked as I can be, so you can shut up and wait. Yeah, that's just fall. Oh, there's actually steps here. Yeah, what's this? Deputy Mulligan tuned Thornton's chatter out. He didn't think riders were particularly useful people, and a huge manhunt for one stuck him as idiotic. Certainly not worth the missed opportunity for coffee and pie. It wasn't even clear what the man had done, except run from them at the trailer park. Mulligan knew he wasn't alone. The sheriff's patience with the Fed was running out. It's a good thing I looked around. I would completely have missed that. And it's probably the only thing. Still looks like it's a lousy well. Meaning that there's actually not a well sunk, it's just so called stones. Seriously? See, bestseller, no reason to worry. Your cutout's good as new, right where I left it. I'll come back for it once we have the place secured. Yeah, that's been my biggest worry. All Why? This time. Why? I need to get this thing moved out of the way. This is as far as I got before they ambushed me. I'm gonna start running around the perimeter. I know the solution's like right there, but I wanna oh, duh, hang on. I just realized I should stop this recording and start the next one. Alright, uh yeah, see you next time. Wait, why am I doing it that way? I'm doing it in the wrong order. I need to stop the recording, then do that. I was distracted because I was thinking that the uh, children of the elder Gar god song is actually one of the things I do enjoy in the soundtrack. It is fun. Oop. I apparently moved too much. Hang on, let me get data back. Makes it easier to crop off the, the CSV. There we go. Alright, uh, see you next time.